like our lives have gotten so nutty lately, it's nice to have a normal person we can rely on. I'm predictable. That's not what I meant. The Sun and Emma. I know what this is about. This has got nothing to do with Byron. Uh huh. You two just confirmed it for me. I'm sick of being dependable, Emma. I need a change. I'm going to colour my hair. Sorry about the tail. I forgot water was involved. You want to keep going? Of course. I'm not stopping now. Whoa. Are you really going this red? Scarlet fever? What? I thought you said it was Indian sunrise. Don't worry. It'll look great. Tim was dragged ashore by a local girl, 16-year-old Louise Chatham. What? How does it feel to be a hero, Louise? I don't feel like that. I just saw him in the surf and dragged him ashore. Mr Hancock told us something big. A monster saved him, but his boat sank about 20 miles offshore. How did he make it back? I'm not sure, but... I didn't see any sea monsters out there. The fisherman, Mr Hancock, provided me with a drawing of what he saw. So for the time being anyway, this reporter is keeping an open mind. It's her, isn't it? What? Well? Well? You were a red clown nose away from selling burgers. <laughs> What have you done to me? But wouldn't the seawater... It's in an old metal chest. So it doesn't mean he's going to be able to open it. Do we really want to take that chance? What's the photo of? Three girls. Miss Chatham and her friends. So it proves she had friends? With tails. It's the same as the one in Miss Chatham's locket, only bigger. Oh no, this is bad. What do you think it was? What? That split them up. What happened to the other two? Maybe that's why Miss Chatham always gives us all that stuff about sticking together. Maybe something happened to her friends that she doesn't want to happen to us. You know, secrets can tear people apart. He saw me. How? Out on Miss Chatham's boat. I was careless. I'm an idiot. Oh, no, don't beat yourself up about it. I mean, look around. No one's going to believe him. He's not going to let it go either, though. All right, look, as long as you don't go in the water, he can't find you. Wait, where's Ricky? 